Hi, this is Mike from MRIS, and I'd like to take two minutes to show you how to enro enroll your SAFE MLS token. When you get to your login screen, if you've never enrolled your token before, there's a link down at the bottom of the login screen that says Enroll My Token. If you click that link, you'll be taken to the enrollment form. The first thing you'll need to do is enter in your MRIS user ID. Then below that, you'll see your standard subscription agreement. This just has some highlights to it that I'd like to point out. The first one that says, uh, if you lose your token, your first token's free, but if you lose your if you lose your token, you are subject to a, a, a replacement fee. Please do not share your tokens. Sharing is prohibited. Uh, you agree to be responsible for and to report any broken or malfunctioning token. Just send it back to us. We'll switch you that. And in the case that you do lose your token and you need an emergency password issued, there is a small administration fee uh, to get that new password issued. So once you've reviewed our enrollment agreement. Down at the bottom of that form is a button that says, I agree. Now we'll go through the registration process. The first thing we have is three secret questions that will help you and help us identify that you're you if we never need to enroll a new token for you. We ask you for your birth city, your birth year, and your maiden name. You don't have to be honest here. Just put in something that you're going to remember. The next thing you'll do is get your safe MLS serial number which is on the back of the token. So just take that token, flip it over, and grab that number right below the barcode. That number we will enter into our form two times to make sure that we type it right. So let's go through and we'll type in that serial number. And then we'll type it in again to make sure that we have no typos. This way, MRIS can associate me with this particular token. And then we have to give it a four digit PIN code. Now, the only restriction on this PIN code is that there has to be at least three different numbers in it. So no number can appear more than two times in it. So type that PIN code in twice, uh, whatever number that you'll remember, click your enroll, enroll your authenticator. We'll take a couple of seconds to register all that information, verify that everything's correct. And then that token is enrolled. So next time you come to MRIS.com, Keystone, or anything like that, you'll now have your three-part authentication all set. Your user ID, your PIN number, and your password that you get off your token. For more tips and tricks, visit MRISblog.com. Thanks.